they came out very hot. They came right at us. Uh, we couldn't recover. Um, they tipped my hat off to them. I mean, they deserve to win. So hey, there's not much to say. What was the message at halftime? Um, they were beating us on the rebounding. Uh, we used to be beating teams on the rebounding. And they were, it was like 15-5 the first 15 minutes. And like... What, what attributed to that? What, what, what made them so successful on the board so early on? Um, I, uh, I feel like they were very physical. And then when we tried to be physical back, um, we got weird calls. But, I mean, that shouldn't be an excuse. But... They were just more physical than us. Would you say this Michigan State was one of the more physical, like the top physical team you guys have played this year? Uh, yes, other than Houston. I feel like if they played, that'd be a really good physical game. But I feel like, you know, they're the top two physical teams we played this year. Did you feel that the team in the beginning of the game just never could, like, figure out the sink? You guys right. were able to figure out the sink in the second half? Right, we couldn't really get together. I feel like we was playing a lot of one-on-one -on -one ball as playing individually. But as we got... In the second half, we came together and like we made our run. We came between five, and then like we just started doing individual things again. And they pulled out on us, and then we just kind of came back together again. But it wasn't, it wasn't enough. We didn't have enough time. How tough was it? I mean, you get it back within four early right. in the half, and they rattle off like three threes in a row, right. or back up down by fifteen. I mean, how how tough is it to? Um, it's really tough, but I feel like we just got to keep, we should have kept our faith. We just got to keep our faith. And, but I feel like tonight wasn't our night. Um, we wasn't really hitting shots like we usually hit shots. Um, the ball wasn't going in for us. So just tonight wasn't our night. How hard is it when you're playing a team with that much tournament experience compared to you guys? Um, tournament experience shouldn't really, really even matter. I mean, they just play harder than us. We didn't play our game, so it doesn't really matter about tournament experience. To me, are you? Is it tough to kind of grasp what you're saying that they that you guys didn't really play as hard as them? Um, yes. I mean that that's our game, and I feel like we played right into their hands. Like we didn't play our game; they played our game, and like it was it was different. It was different. What, now, what is the biggest thing that you took away from this season? Um, a lot of things. Cherish moments. Um, just just love each other and just be happy to be around each other because I feel like we, we'll never be able to lace up together this collective group right here ever again. So just cherish the moments. Now, are you, is there a possible return next year for you? Oh, indeed. I'm not ready to go nowhere. Like I feel like I have a lot of stuff to improve, uh, ball handling, shooting the ball better, my percentages go up, uh, being able to guard more positions. Um, I have a lot more to improve. Now, do you think near the end of the season it became more mentally draining with all the things that were going off the court? Um, no, I feel like it was. It wasn't. It didn't really matter because we just stayed in as a family and like we just blocked out the outside noise. It's like it wasn't really like. I mean, it was there, but we wasn't really paying attention to it.